organistas another unboxing can you believe it i've been growing my collection like a mad woman for the past few months i did not expect this package until friday it's thursday dog started barking doorbell was ringing i was like what is this this is four phalaenopsis orchids in here from Norman's Orchids in California. Their website is orchids.com. And I am so excited about these Phalaenopsis. I recently purchased a Phalaenopsis that is the first one in my collection and it has a scent. It smells wonderful. I had to have some more. I just need some Phalaenopsis in my life that have a smell to them. Now, okay, there should be two orchids in here, I'm so excited, that are in bud or blooming. Oh my gosh, blooming. Oh my gosh. Let me let y'all take a peek. Can you see, can you see, yeah. can you see that? <gasps> Look at that flower. Oh, and uh, spikes. I see spikes just wanting to come in. Oh my goodness, we got to get rid of this styrofoam so I can find the plants. Okay, this one here is the one with the flowers right here. Oh, they taped it in. They taped it in for crazy people so that we would have to slow down. <laughs> I saw pictures of this. Um, they did a live stream of the, um, the greenhouse and I saw all of these sitting on the bench and I was like, what is it? What is it? That is so pretty. Okay. Alrighty. Can we please get out? <laughs> oh my goodness. They have really taped it down in there. So good. Hey, can't stand it. Such good packing. <laughs> oh, goodness gracious. Okay, so would you look at those? Oh my gosh, look at that. There's six buds on there. Blooms, what am I talking about? Look at that baby right there. Oh my goodness. This is Phalaenopsis Sogo Lawrence, and the cultivar or the clonal name is F. 1982 it has been awarded by the american orchid society it has an award of merit from the american orchid society oh let's put this back in there i'm so excited i can't stand it oh look 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 okay so no scent yet which i kind of didn't expect it was going to have a scent coming straight out of the box uh i would going to give it till maybe tomorrow or the next day. Look, it's got great roots. It's got a little aerial root right there. Can you see that? This is so cute. Okay, this spike. Oh, we have more batting. Either to protect the spike or that is going to mean that there are blooms under here. Let me see if we can get this one out here. Okay, 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 okay. I'm, I'm hurrying, I'm trying. Alrighty, let's get this little baby out. Okay, I know what this is. Wait, what? Okay, um, not quite sure what this is because it's not one that I ordered. I didn't order this one. So I'll definitely have to be letting, um, yeah, um, I didn't order this one. <laughs> it's in Spike. Um, this is supposed to be, oh, let me try to remember the name of it. Um, it's something, oh, it's Phalaenopsis Sunset Gemstone Tahiti. That's what this is supposed to be. And the tag says Phalaenopsis Sogo Yinlin Verica. This is supposed to be a variegated orchid. 
they have mislabeled this. And this is possibly not the first time I've gotten something from them that's been mislabeled. It's, it's lovely spike on it. Yay. Um, but it is definitely not variegated. So I'm going to have to look this up online and see what this is. It's a cross between Sogo Vivian and Sogo Berry. And it's called Sogo Yinlin Variegata. Hopefully the camera will focus and you can see that, but I will put it up on the screen so you can read it. Not a problem. Okay. Let's set that one down to the side and get in here to one of them that I am so excited about. And this next plant here. Okay. All right. Oh, cute, cute, cute. Oh, oh, yay, yay, yay. This is another one that was supposed to be in bud. And it is. It is. It has bloomed before. It has um, blooms, old bloom spikes, but it has a, grow, a uh, bloom spike right here. And then this bloom spike here that I see currently four buds on. This one here, so excited about it. This is Phalaenopsis Kenneth Schubert. And let me see if I can pronounce the clonal name. It's like um, Hauline Blue Wave or Holland Blue Wave. This is a primary hybrid between Violacea and Pulcherima. Those are two species. And this is a primary hybrid of those two and this flower i'm gonna put it up on the screen because i just think it is adorable gorgeous color this is going to be a blue this will be a blue flower and what the pulcherima that it is crossed with is pyloric so it gives a little um not really i don't think it's called a picotee but you'll see in the pictures lovely 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 little roots coming out down here at the bottom very very good okay and then the next one that i got in and it wasn't supposed to be um spiking and that was fine uh i just thought that it was a cute flower and also it is supposed to be fragrant okay so this one here is phalaenopsis ison ison Venus Sweet Fate Fragrant. Excuse me. Sweet Fragrant. So, let me show you that tag there. Hopefully that will then focus. Because I really can't see what's on the screen. So I'm hoping you can see that and then it is focused. So, so exciting. I did not, like I said, expect this today. I thought we were going to be doing our video on a different day put them all in here and I am going to jump on the phone and call Norman's orchid and find out what happened to the other orchid that I ordered to the um, sunset no, yes sunset gemstone clonal name is Tahiti I that was supposed to be a, a, a real big orange hence the sunset colors so anyway there's my babies. I'm so excited. You guys, you know what I'm going to say. Happy orchid growing. Have a wonderful day. Until next time. Bye.